This week's story is Sue Potato by Sue Hendra. Some vegetables are frozen for a very good reason. Don't believe me? Then keep reading. It was night time in the supermarket. All was quiet. But crash, bang, something escaped from the freezer. Something small, round and green. Help, help, cried Carrot. I'm stuck to the conveyor belt. Ah, cried Broccoli. Somebody's drawn on my face. Hmm, said the cucumber. Who is doing this? And was there anyone who could help these vegetables in distress? Super Tato to the rescue! He used his super speed. He used his super strength. He used a flannel and some soapy water. I know who is behind this, said Sue Potato. There is a pea on the loose. <gasps> oh no, not a pea, everyone gasped. Yes, a pea, ha ha ha. I'm out of the freezer now and I'm never going back. Ha ha ha. And the evil pea ran off to commit more terrible crimes. Time for a little dip, veggies. That! Enough, shouted Super Potato. He leapt towards the pea, but his pea popped out of his hands and vanished into thin air. Super Potato set out on a super search. He crept through the cakes, he checked the cheese, and he snuck up on the beans. Then something caught his eye. The game is up, yelled Sue Potato, but the pea bounced out of reach and onto a trolley. Sue Potato was just about to stop him with his super strength when the trolley crashed and he was thrown down, down into the depths of the freezer. Was this the end of Sue Potato? <gasps> Not quite, but the pea was off his trolley and lying in wait. You are Finish, Sue Potato, he shrieked, but Sue Potato summoned up all his strength and he ran for it. The pea nearly had him at the beans and closed him at the cheese. He had him cornered by the cakes. So much for Sue Potato, screeched the pea. You are about to be mashed, Potato. Surely this was the end for Sue Potato. Not today, my friend, said Super Potato. Gotcha, <coughs> said the pea. Oh yes, said Super Potato. I'll trap you. And you fell for it. Or should that be in it? And he grinned a super grin. Super Potato had saved the day. Take him away, he said. And the pea was marched back to the freezer where he belonged. This jelly tastes of pea, said Broccoli. And everybody laughed and cheered. So, remember folks. Some vegetables are frozen for a very good reason. Maybe you better go back and check your freezer just in case. There's an escape in your house. Hope you enjoyed the story. See if you can do some of the activities that I've put in.